student really is the center. Each student has the attention uh, and, uh, and the care and the love that requires for them to focus their, their energy, their time. It's a very precious process that I feel I, I have been privileged to be part of. So when I first came to uh, Duquesne uh, as the director of the library, uh, in those days, uh, the, the library, the law school was in the Rockwell Hall. It occupied 7th, 8th, 9th. Then after I came, we took over 10th floor. Very uh, small collection, and the collection were not even classified, and no, no computer, no uh, electronic, uh, electronic resources. The new law school building was established, was, was built. I was in charge of transform, you know, move the library to the new building. It's like building a building, and you build it brick by brick, you know. I think what uh, makes uh, Duquesne a wonderful place to work is that um, uh, everybody tried to help you. I think the first, uh, the first time that I would be, I work with, with uh, other, uh, the, the colleagues of other school, uh, dates back to 1990, uh, when I uh, thought it was an opportunity to, for Duquesne to reach out to China. So we started this faculty exchange. Then a few years later, we studied, we started a summer, st study of Chinese law program. Students who came to, our students who came to China, after they came back, they said, invariably, they would say, it changed their life. Uh, 40 years uh, went by like that. If you say, how does Duquesne uh, shape a person? And what kind of person that may be? You could be, you could say, you know, look at Frank Liu, that, <laughs> that's kind of like a Duquesne guy. <laughs>